people, I'm Jennifer Ziliotto. Today I wanted to take a few minutes with you and go through all my scarves. Right now I'm storing them in a very messy, overflowing drawer. I wanna take them out of there, go through them all, and rearrange them in my closet. I feel like scarves are such an amazing accessory to transition from one season to the next. So I wanna take advantage of being able to see them all so I can really wear them and enjoy them. One of the types of scarves I've been wearing a lot lately are my Hermes scarves, which you know I love. And I decided to keep them separate from my other scarves. And that's because they're silk and a little bit more delicate and wrinkle easily. So I've been folding them nicely and keeping them in their, in their box or just like this. And I had given them a little area on the ledge in my closet. I'm gonna show you afterward. And that's when I realized you know what, my, so my scarf drawer is just not working for me. And that really I should put all my scarves piled on top of each other on that ledge so I can really see them and they're easier to access than this drawer. Okay, I wanted you to actually see how messy this drawer is. It's stuffed to the brim, so let's get started. It's actually a little bit embarrassing to show you how messy I can be, but life gets in the way. So I'm just gonna start by taking everything out of here so that I can see what I have, so that I can sort through them. <laughs> the drawer is empty and I know what you're thinking, like how many scarves does this woman have? But they're not all scarves. They're actually hats, um, gloves, scarves, Pereros. So I'm going to get rid of all the things I don't want to keep in my room anymore, which is all my winter hats I've decided, and all my winter gloves. There's by far enough room downstairs in the closet. I think I was just keeping them here because I didn't want them to get mixed up with everybody else's, but that was something I tackled a while ago, so there's a space for me to put those things, so now it's gonna be so much easier. Okay, so the first thing that I've done is eliminated all the winter hats and gloves and all the things that I use for running, for instance. All that is gonna go somewhere else. And then I also decided that I'm gonna take out these Pereros from the scarf drawer these I'm gonna store somewhere else. These are really a summertime thing. They're not really necessarily a scarf. And these can go, I don't know where yet, but somewhere else. One of the things that I think is really important when you're going through any of your drawers or your closet is to make sure that you're looking for things that, first of all, you never wear, so it's time to get rid of it. And second of all, things that are really not in good condition anymore. Now, sometimes this can be a little bit hard because we have an emotional attachment like for instance, for me, it is this bandana, okay? It's ripped, it's got holes, it's in terrible condition. But I've had this bandana for probably about 30 years. It was one of the first things I ever bought when Club Monaco opened and I loved it. And I've been wearing it so the fabric is nice and soft, but I don't think I'm gonna repair it. So I think that instead of throwing this away, I'm going to retire this to the rag drawer. The so next what I wanna do is I want to, I want to divide um, the scarves into categories, kind of. Like colors, like fabrics. I like organizing my closet this way as well. There's a reason why. Because I find it easier when you're in the mood for a certain color or you're in the mood for a certain style, when everything is grouped, it's easier to see how you can mix and match. And also, especially with scarves, if, for instance, I find I'm wearing the same sweater dress three days in a row, to give you an example, then if I can really see my scarves grouped in categories of color and texture, then I can just change the accessory and nobody really knows I'm wearing the same dress all week. All right, as you can see, I've folded everything and I've put them in um, sections of all the plaids together, all these sort of wooly light colors, going a little bit more summery and light and then all my neutrals and then of course are all my Hermes here. So they're all put away. Everything fits if you can believe it. I feel like it's really easy to see and decide which scarves I want to wear. So that's it. Hope you liked this video. I hope it inspired you to go through one of the drawers or the cupboards in your house that needs a little bit of attention because really like what did that take? 15 minutes? So easy and such a nice sense of accomplishment 
and now I feel totally inspired to put together some new looks. So that's the fun part. Hope you liked this video. If you did, don't forget to give it a thumbs up. Leave a comment down below letting me know either your favorite scarf or how you store your scarves. I do really want to know. And of course, for more style ideas and more inspiration, you know what to do. You can continue to follow me on Facebook and on Instagram. And lastly, do not forget to subscribe to my YouTube channel.